I'm Trey. I'm Blake. And we are the owners of St. Germain in New Orleans. Half the building is a wine bar. The other side of the building is the tasting menu only dining room. And that's where we come up with this unique menu. Simplicity is something that's really important for us. The never ending pursuit of trying to make sure that things evolve. We do cook very, very seasonally. We try to do local as much as possible. The bar patrons can actually get some of the dining room dishes in a more cozy manner. New Orleans might be one of the most French cities in the United States. Deep rooted in the passion of food, people want to come and like experience New Orleans and there's so many different ways they can experience that keeps you on your toes. So we're at Guy's Po' Boy Shop, a local spot that really sums up what the traditional po' boy should be. This one is the one that reminds me of the one my mom used to make the most. When you go to a true local po' boy shop, you can see the pride. Like this place knows that they do some of these po' boys better than anybody else in the city. When you see a classic place like this, that means it's a really special place. You really do need to experience the sandwich made by someone who loves it and is very proud of what they're serving you. It, it gives you a real view of the city, I think. So we're at Hi-Hat Restaurant. Both the food and the service are incredibly welcoming. You will see lots of people that come the same day every week to get the same special. They have elements of Mississippi Delta Diner, but then they also have boudin and po' boys and things like that. It makes me feel like the type of spread my grandmother would put out. It feels good to sit down in a place and be able to feel comfortable. And when I get this type of food, that's the kind of feeling that I like to have. If I'm looking to be transported back to my childhood, there's no other place I'm thinking of going than here. So we're at Faubourg Wines. The low ceilings and the wood, it kind of reminds us of being in France. We really like the owner and a lot of the people that work here. They're very hands-on with the wine that's here. Like I'm not the biggest wine person, so it's easy to come in and talk to somebody that's very welcoming and like passionate about what they do. You can sit down at their little wine bar here and try some things that you might want to get. I would definitely recommend this place, particularly if you rented a house that you need to stock up while you're here. You just can't go wrong with the wines here. We're at Bar Tonique. It's my favorite bar in the city. It is a dive bar, but it has the craftsmanship of making cocktails. A place where you'll see both locals and people visiting the city. They think about the drink as much as really good chefs think about food. My favorite drink here is the Brandy Milk Punch. I never get it anywhere else. It is a place that you will get recommended a lot if you ask people that work in restaurants. We're at Bacchanal Wine Bar. This might be one of the most unique places in the city. A place that you can go to that's live music outside. The natural wine selection is awesome. Get a bunch of friends together, get a couple of bottles of wine, get a couple shared plates and kind of just go at it like that. It's like an escape from the quintessential New Orleans touristy thing that everybody also wants to do. A place that you have to go to if you're in New Orleans. The city's got soul. It's something that is hard to leave once you're used to living in a place like this. Mm -hmm.